gonna show you how we can add instruments to Logic Pro. So you can build up your session. There's a couple of ways we can do it. Now, the most simple way is to head up to the little plus icon just up here. When we tap on this, we've got a software instrument. And then in the instrument tab just here, we can actually browse through all of our plugins and choose what we're gonna add straight off the bat. So Alchemy is always a good place to start. So we could just have it on Alchemy and it will load up one for us. Now at the bottom here, it says number of tracks to create. I mean, let's say we wanted to add four in. We're now gonna put four in. It's gonna create four instances of Alchemy for us. So let's hit create. And as you can see here, I've now got a stack of four Alchemy is all back to back. Now what about if you want to change whatever's loaded? That's easy enough. So if we select int 15 here and we can press X to bring our mixer up, we can see that's also highlighted up here. It says Alchemy. So what we can do here is click on here and it brings up that same list we saw before on where we went to add our instruments and we can choose anything we like from there. For example, we've now got retro synth. We can also do this by adding empty channels. So where we went to the software instrument before, instead of having alchemy, we can do empty channel strip. We could do create, and that's gonna give us an empty strip. And then we could load our plugin from there, whichever it is we wanted to do. What if we wanted to load a preset? Well, there's a way to do that as well. If we have an empty channel strip like we do just here, we can go over to our library, which is the icon just up here, or we can press Y to bring the library up. While this empty strip is selected, we can go and find the kind of preset we're after. Let's say we're looking for a keyboard and we wanna have an idea of what we're after. Whatever we select here, we'll now load in. We want a feedback road. Once we click feedback roads, it will load into that strip just there. Hope that video is helpful for you. If you wanna learn a little bit more about Logic, check out the playlist that's linked on the screen right now for many more videos. Look forward to seeing you in those. Take care.